Hayden. I contacted our general manager. He's the one who's like in charge of right now. He let us know we're actually not currently hiring uh, anybody right now because we're Oh no. Season. Okay. Uh, so not even for the mascot? Well, no, because that's not like a specific role. Yeah, that's okay. something that like lots of people do. Okay. Yeah, I want to be in the, the ch kids check-in people like what she does. That's what I applied for. All I know is that right now we're not currently hiring anybody. Okay. We don't have the, we, we, like we're in our slow season right now, so they don't provide us with enough hours okay. to actually like add anybody new to the Okay. Is your well, like August or September when, when, when like, school is back in session? Exactly. That's when one your busiest? Yeah, so our, our slowest months are December and May. Oh, wow. Um, and then we start picking up near the end of summer, beginning into school year, something like that. Um, but it's just kind of a toss up right now. Like, you know, we've also got. A good number of employees right now. Okay. We actually don't like ever really need. So it just kind of depends on if people end up like leaving when they go, if they go back to school or off to school. Or if they move, you know, just kind of like okay. Just, well, you guys could give me a call when when you guys. Uh, Ambrose. A M B. Yeah, yeah. Laura Ambrose. Right, when you guys need me. <laughs> All right. All right. Hope to see you soon. Yeah. Yeah. I hope to work with you soon. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. That would be cool. Yeah, that could be cool. Yeah. Oh, have a good one. Hi, right, you too. Thanks Bye. for the free drink, though. Yeah, of course. <laughs> hey. Oh, cheese. How you doing? Ready for fun? Oh, So they're not hiring at the moment. Yeah, they gave me a free drink. They're not hiring at the moment. Yeah, they're, they, are, they're They said by August or September. Oh, fuck. They said by August or September. They might. Okay, so this is a nice, cool place here. So let's go over this before I take you home. Okay. All right, so now it, some of the things you said to Emily, did they involve a firearm? No. In, it's only the check marks. Grandma. I know, but the, the checks here is there's not clear evidence that the respondent is you may use a firearm. So, did you say something about it? No. Okay. And then you were present in court. Okay, but here's you are to stop engaging in or threatening to engage in physical abuse, emotional abuse, sexual abuse, treatment without consent. I already know that, Grandma. They went over this with me. and Or the mistreatment of an animal. Did you threaten to harm copper? No. Well, I don't know why that's in there. Okay, the response, okay, we avoid her evidence. Avoid any contact. <laughs> And that's all. If you do have to contact her for something. I could have a police officer or something contact. If I, let's just say if I break any of these rules, I'll be going to jail. That's what yes. will happen. Yes, it says. Uh... Yes, yeah, she could go to jail for not up to nine months or pay a fine of a thousand dollars. Yeah, so do not break it. I'm not okay. Yeah, all right. It's serious business. It's too bad that Emily went and did that, but yeah. It's too bad that Emily went and did that. Yes. They already weren't having any association. Voluntarily, right? Yeah. So she must have really been a 
afraid. All right. So yeah, because the people down. on my live went and threatened her to kill her. Okay, the people did that. Did they come up with the court? Did they know that you didn't threaten to do that? But no, they I, they never said. Asked me about threat, like threatening to kill her. They just said. Uh, about the me going and punching her and hitting her and knocking her door down. They didn't mention anything about me threatening to kill her. Okay. Okie dokie. So we're just going straight home, right? Yeah. Yeah. Oh, I like 